Good afternoon everyone, welcome back to JMC Creates. My name is Jackie McKissick and today I'm on to show you my new purchase. Now, this was a big decision because I've always had a Gemini, which and the first foil and system I bought was a foil press. And I was really happy with it. Didn't have any problems. But my Gemini I had a problem with. I've gone through three Geminis. So I have. So the other day I says to David, I says, what should I do? Should I... First of all, I researched the Glimmer and the Big Shot. And I watched some videos of it working. That one's a wee bit too much, but I thought I might be able to cut a little circle out or something. This one I love. But anyway, I researched it and then I says to David, should I spend £100 on a new Gemini Junior, despite having gone through three of them, or should I spend £130 on a glimmer machine from Spellbinders, I got it at Crashdash. So we mulled it over and we decided we should try the glimmer machine. And as you can see from what I am showing you, this I absolutely adore this. This is glitter card. Oh my god, it makes me so happy. And so this one here I'll have to cut out like this, but I can do that, I'm feeling brave, not, never, anyway, so, so those are some of the foil plates that I have that I messed about with. I also have Pink Fresh Studio Perfect Sentiments and these are The sentiments I cut out. And also, I have the Christmas one of those. And I have Christmas sentiments. Christmas sentiments for days. Oh my word, look how many. I like this Merry's Christmas. And generally, what's what? I don't use a lot of that, but I keep cutting it out because it's there. And these, I have cut these all. These have all been cut once in the foil and twice in a different, this is some old orange cardstock, and they're all layered three times, okay? Takes a little bit of doing, but worth it, and then I just have to pop one in when I need it. Now, these here are not layered three times yet, but we will get to that. So, I thought I'd pop on and tell you what I've been doing, because... My craft room is an absolute state. TJ sits to the left of me on the computer and um, pulls out the bottom drawer of my Alex drawers and sits and deals his feet on them. And this new seat is a little bit higher, so he's pulled out the second drawer up and diddled his feet on it. And the upshot is, after a lot of TJ's attention, they broke. So I have to go and look. When David's finished nights, I have to go and look for a new table and chairs for Christmas. And a set of drawers. And I don't really want to go by the Alex drawers again. Kiss I am. So I'm going to go to some charity shop hunting. Uh, there's a little marketplace down here, and um, he doesn't. It's, it's only set in my craft room. It doesn't have to be the bee's knees. It just has to hold stuff. So uh, we've decided that's what we're going to do. And if we don't get anything suitable, then we'll go back to IKEA and get another set of Alex trucks. So anyway. Thank you for watching, listen to me complain, sun or on, whatever the heck you want to call it. I do appreciate it.
I appreciate it. Every time you do anything for me, comment, subscribe, thumbs up, whatever you do. Thank you. I hope you're all safe and well. And until the next time, Jackie out.